to show the whole world what we're all about. We're the girls with a passion for fashion. Ooh, we're rats. We'll always be there for each other. Ooh, we're rats. Yeah. Styling how we feel. Ooh, talking about our best friends. Yeah. Together we can do anything. We all gotta plan the dream. Take a chance and believe. Make it real. tonight? Actually, I have to reschedule. Dylan's in the dumps because some girls stood him up, so I said we'd hang tonight. Is that cool with you? Oh, yeah. Very cool. If you define cool as totally reeking, that is. on me! How rude! And you and Cameron are finally going on a date? A study date. And no, we're not going. Cameron could apparently care less about my chemistry grade. Two under the sea. So uh, you're worried about chemistry class, not the chemistry between you and Cam? I don't know what you're talking about. Eh, uh, two look at me. I mean, even if I'd ever considered Cameron as boyfriend material, I'm so done. He clearly can't even keep a simple appointment. Ugh, too tweevily. Hey, Angel, are your parents still out of town? Yeah, they'll be back on Sunday. Scorching! Sleepover tonight at your place. Nothing like a sleepover. Ha! The brats are having a slumber party. Yeah! Yeah! Why do we care? Because we can, like, spy on them, stupid. And by the way, that dress is, like, so not our color. Here, try this on instead. <laughs> Yo, pretty princess! Sleepover at Angel's. I'll bring the face masks. Hang on, Bunny Boo. Got another call. Yes, here. What's up, pretty princess? This just in. Slumber party at Chloe's. Hot. Hey, cool cat! Sleep over at your place, pass it on. Awesome! Finally, those monstrous little brats have made their fatal mistake. A sleepover? I will crush them like the worms they are. Yeah! yeah. We'll find out what they say about us. Which one of us they hate the most? Silence! How did I end up with you feeble-minded interns? Back in my glory days when I was an agent for the International Fashion Police. Oh, never mind. Tonight, the brats will yap about their stupid magazine. It'll be your job to spy on them and find out the plans for the next issue. Yeah! Now, to be a spy, you have to be strong. You have to be sneaky. You have to be smart. Yeah. yeah! Mother of pink, you're morons! You don't have the brains or the brawn to spy on your own. <sighs> well, you're clearly gonna need gadgetry. Now pay attention. These aren't just ordinary classic pink pumps. They're top of the line multifunctional spy gear. They have spikes for climbing, microphones for eavesdropping, hidden bungee cords for jumping rope. Don't interrupt. Hidden bungee cords for <gasps> macrame. <sighs> oh, why do I even bother? And best of all, the boomerang. By this time tomorrow, all the brats' secrets will be mine. Mine! Mine! Ow! Well, 
close enough. Just don't screw it up. Don't let the brats see you. Okay, people, listen up. According to my research, dancing is the 10th most rockinest sleepover activity. What are you talking about, Bunny Boo? Well, I checked out over 60 slumber party websites and have made a schedule for what, statistically speaking, should be the most groovalicious sleepover ever. Cool! There's Chloe's bedroom. Climb up. No, you! I'm scared of heights. I'd get a nosebleed if I climbed to the top of a bunk bed. Fine. We'll play a game. Rock, scissors, paper. Oh, I love games. One, two, three, go! Oh. Rock beats scissors. Get to climbing. Oh. <sighs> Time! Rock and a sleepover activity number nine. Guess the drawing. <laughs> what? Someone has to draw a picture and everyone has to guess what it is. Oh, oh, I've got one. A skeleton. Um, a, a supermodel. Right wig. Electricity? Are you going for electricity? Mm, an eagle. A peacock. I know, a dove! A dead eagle! A dead peacock? Dead bird? Bird! Bird rash! Bird poop? Continues. Rockin' a sleepover activity number eight. Pin the bandage on Casey's nose! Ew! Ew. Chloe, isn't this better than studying with Cameron? Cameron who? <laughs> <laughs> this is, like, so scary. I can't even believe she's making me do this. She's so mean. Don't look down. What did you say? Don't look down! Now that extreme makeover rules! Like, where are my pink pleated socks? Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Ugh, it's a little cold in here, Angel. Could you close the window? No prob, cool cat. Did you guys hear something weird? Angel, I think your wild imagination is putting in for overtime. What's this, Angel? Oh, those are my costumes. Just in case I need something last minute, but not last year. Coolness. That'll work. Rocking a sleepover activity number seven, the runway strut. Because we're the girls with a passion for... Fashion! Darling, pretty princess gone wild! Go, Jade! Go, Jade! Get crazy! Rockin'! Burlips will, like, kill us if we don't get their plans for the next issue. And be, like, really mad. Then keep going!
We've now completed activity number six, raiding the fridge. Back upstairs, people. What was that? A cat burglar? You don't have a cat. A real burglar? Oh, I'm sure it was nothing. <gasps> what was that? I'm sure it's nothing, but just to be safe. What am I supposed to do with a banana? It was the first thing I grabbed. Shh. Did you hear that? A thief or oh, so much worse. A total psychopath could be picking the lock and breaking in. I haven't done everything I want to do with my life. I still have articles to write and clothes to buy and boys to kiss. I'm too young to die at the monstrous hands of an ice-blooded, cold-hearted killer. <laughs> Guys, chill. It's just a facial mask. <sighs> I knew that. Phew. It's all natural. Eggs, oatmeal, and anchovies. Ew. Ew! Pretty princess, you are so weird. It's so hot in here, my face mask is turning into an omelet. Do you mind? That's it, Dipwad. You're such a total spaz. From now on, I do the climbing. Tell me you guys heard that. Sorry, Angel. Not again, Chloe. <gasps> uh, we have an agenda, ladies. Let's get to it. Rockin' a sleepover activity number five. Uh... Seance. Hum. Hum. Oh, great ghost of fashion. We are your rockin' Hum. servants. Hum. We respectfully ask you to please come to Hum. us tonight. Hum. We are searching for some answers. Hum. Hum. Stripes will be in, but I will be coming out of my grave. It worked! We channeled the ghost! Oh, great ghost, what about bell bottoms? Will they come back? Oh, yes, they will be coming back, and so will I. C coming back from the dead for revenge on you. Okay, very funny. Who was that? Not me. Not me? Me neither, Bunny Boo. Then who was it? This is like it. One way or another, we're going in. In the slingshot now. Stupid brats. The door was open all along. Burglar break-ins are not on my top ten list. This is it, girls. Time to defend the casa. Who's with me? All for one. And one for all. I go with dignity to my death. Here. We weren't sneaking. 
We were in the neighborhood and thought we'd drop by. Didn't you hear us knock? Can we at least stay until Casey recovers from her boo-boo? Okay, fine, you can stay. But this is a slumber party, and slumber parties have rules. Ooh, a party, yay! Yeah. Okay, rockin' a sleepover activity number three. Makeovers, go! I think I'll try two colors, a little yin-yang. Guys, this sleepover rocks! Thanks for helping me forget all about what's his name. Back to our countdown. Time for activity number two, people. Fishing. Yeah. yeah. We're like so excellent at gossip. <laughs> I'm not into talking about people. We're together 24 seven. There's nothing we don't know. There's like stuff we don't know. Like Chloe, why did Cameron stand you up? Um, he didn't. He had a friend in need. I can respect that. You're like so touchy feely. More gossip, more gossip! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> We've got stories about Bourdine that you wouldn't believe. Well, I don't think we need to hear all that. Before Bird Brain eats anything, she rinses it like three times in soda water just in case someone's trying to poison her. Okay, four times. Oh, yeah, and her gray hair grows so fast that, like, every morning she colors it in with a highlighter. <laughs> Ew! Yeah, and she shaves her feet. Yeah! yeah. Ew. Ew! And she eats baby birds. Come on, she does not eat baby birds. Yeah, that's how she gets her name. Get it? Bird Dean. Uh. Ew. Ew. Ah! Chill. I bet the boys are trying to prank us. Let's take them down, people. Let's get them. Cotton balls? I'm a conscientious objector to violence. The dudes don't have a chance. One, two, three! What do you think, girls? Cameron, Dylan, or Eaton? Ha <laughs> ha! We got him! Yeah! Cameron? Eaton took over on Dylan cheer-up duty, so I figured I'd come over and help you study. If you just left Eaton and Dylan, then who's that? <laughs> Stupid brats! It's like a real burglar, and we captured him! So we get the reward! had to check on you imbeciles. Together, you don't have half the brains of a head of lettuce. I knew you nincompoops couldn't be trusted to perform a simple act <laughs> of surveillance. <laughs> Since Dylan is covered, are you still up for studying together? Thanks, Cameron. But now I'm hanging with the girls. Our chemistry's going to have to wait a little while longer. Then I guess I'll just stick around for the sleepover. <laughs> Not on your life. <laughs> Sorry, Cam. Girls only. Bye, Cameron. Our rockin' sleepover became the cover story for our next issue. Slumber party secrets revealed. <laughs> <laughs> What's next on the list, Bunny Boo? And now, the number one rockin' sleepover activity, truth or dare. Stay tuned for our next issue.
everybody now. 